Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Garrett, and welcome back to Watch Dog Legion on the Xbox One X. Last episode, we got our first member of DeadSec back, and we're trying to scrum up some data on the police department and these, this militant group around here to uh, be able to fight back a little bit, get the people back on our side. And I know I need to go down below got to get down there which is fine just want to kind of because i gotta we gotta get that door unlocked to get that door unlocked i gotta get down here to where the power for the door is just the two guys i think it's just the two the one across there and the one here oh no there's a third is that a third Kind of, yeah. Ugh. Oh, is that a civilian? That might be a civilian. I don't know. I can't tell. that. Bada boom. Okay, that door should be open now. So far, so good. I've been quiet. This must be a record for me. Hold on here. What was that over here? Grab the ammo. Might as well. Crack that open. You guys can pause and read that if you would like. Bada boom. Badly. What you got for me? A list of what Albion consider high-value targets that are threats to the peaceful running of London. See here? A journalist. And this one runs a community shelter. Good God. Bar your doors. W.T. Fuck? All suspected of sowing rebellion or exhibiting tendencies towards... <laughs> Albion is systematically arresting people even before they rise up. Joke's on them. This list can actually help us find like-minded allies willing to help us. Well done. Now, Beautiful. let's disrupt some of Albion's propaganda and give some hope to the people. So essentially, kind of like what Bloom was doing prior in, in 1 and 2, they were pre-conditioning pre, uh, people. They were just kind of uh, just saying, oh, you, you're a you have the possibility of being bad, therefore we're going to arrest you or keep a close eye on you. Oh! Oh, sorry! Whoopsie! Remind me when I get out of the car here. I'm going to look in the settings real quick to see if we can just shut off the radio. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me. I said excuse me, okay? I mean, what else do you want from me? I'm kind of winging it here. The world looks pretty good from the car view, at least. I mean, it, it's, it's, uh, I would love to see this with RTX. 
It makes me want to sell this copy and go to the PC just to see how good it looks. Especially with all the rain effects going on right now. I think it'd look pretty good. Okay, I want to check my settings. Two seconds. Beautiful. There is a setting for it. Hey, good news. I just scratched off my Albion Propaganda bingo card. Guess they don't want us forgetting who's in charge, right? There's going to be that much less once you're done here. Let's give Camden a break from these eyesores. Piss easy. I got this. How far away is that? Okay, this is down the road. I was like, jeez. What a fancy looking car I took. Sorry. You see me backing up. Not my fault. If you hijack that scissor lift, you could use it to access the rooftop. Yeah. Done that. Up. Ooh, I did it. Bada boom. Climb the pipe. Don't take that dirty. Naughty, naughty people. Yeah, I, I heard you thinking. Hold A to automatically jump over gaps. Okay. Oh, geez. You just seriously just kind of teleport to it. All right. Beautiful. We'll probably want to get out of here. Nicely done. That'll get people's attention. Let them know someone is standing up to Albion. Light the spark that they can stand up to. If nothing else, it'll relieve their eye strain. What now? <laughs> We're already seeing results from what you've done. That list we found named a journalist in Camden who's been investigating Albion. We reached out, and he's got information that can help us. I think you should meet with him. Send me the coordinates. Oh, I love that car. How far away do we got? Oh, that's super far. Is there an easy way I can... Uh... There we go. No. Ah! <laughs> You got my way. You were dancing out of the wrong way. Weather effect is really nice. I like the kind of gloomy look ever on everything. The rainy look is really solid. I really kind of hope that there's like actual like downpour rain and things like that, but nothing yet. Heard you need some help. What's up? Your recruiter's been sticking it to Albion. Can't believe someone else is. Thought I was alone, right? Not doing much, just putting the word out. But you? Taking action, mate. Yeah, well, I was getting pretty bored sitting around watching old sitcoms. Plus, you know, go democracy or whatever. So, what'd you have for us? Almost got clip finding this. All of Albion's operational data for the entire city. Convoy routes, surveillance targets, assets. It's all there. Thinking you can make good use of that. That's for fucking sure. Here's a sample. Albion's closed King's Cross to the public, right? 
But what people don't know is that they're using it as their logistics centre, materials, troops, whatever. A lot of it runs through there. You want to give the people a huge boost? Hit that place. Put it out of commission and you'll severely hamstring Albion's operations here in Camden. Hell, everywhere. Sounds like a plan to me. Okay. Excuse me? Yeah, man, somebody parked their car here all dumb-like. That's right over here. I moved my car, it's Our fine. Operational plans are just what we needed to really get some traction. We'll have to take a close look at this. Now, how do we take King's Cross offline? Albion's housed a massive hybrid power generator in there. Output must be immense. You cause a power surge in that base and boom. So, I know a lunatic. Get into that generator. Sorry about that. Easy. They've locked it up tight. Oh, good. It just keeps the dialogue going. What should I do? My new drones are still in here. They should be functional. You can use one of them. Probably have better luck piloting it too, yeah? Okay, where would be... Oh. So I get this. I'm trying to see if I can find somewhere else I can bounce to. He's like, hey, wait a moment. Somebody knocked me offline. But I don't see. Oh, oh, there it is. I was like, there should be something else. Come on now. Okay, hi, Jack. Well, causing hi, a power surge in a hybrid power generator isn't like making a toasty. We're going to need detailed specifications. We've got to check it out. Check this out, man. Cool, looks bloody complicated. Knows he's got a pretty functional camera. Would a picture do you, Bagley? It would indeed. According to this, there's an override code that'll get us into the generator's system. Okay. Uh. Too crazy. We're just fine. We are a, a drone just like everybody else here. Everything's fine. Everything's cool. Your, your guys are cool. I'm cool. We're all cool. That's it. Use the code on the generator and I can trigger a power surge. It should be enough to take King's Cross offline and the rail system too. Okay. Here we go. Let's have some fun, kids. Where the fireworks come from? Albion convoys, informants, gear, you name it. Everything we need to ignite the people of London, like we did in Camden. Derail Albion's operations and give the people a reason to rise up, borough by borough. The more we do that, the more we'll get allies flocking to the cause. We'll show London that DedSec is here for them.
This is kind of cool. Okay. That was off the chain, mate. I knew DeadSec weren't the bad guys Albion was saying. Now the rest of Camden will too. Thanks. Cheers, mate. Now that you've shown the borough what DeadSec is really all about, there are going to be folks wanting to join up. A lot of people have been looking for a way to fight back. In fact, there's one in particular I suspect will contact you very soon. I happen to know they're champion at the bit. Yeah, we don't exactly have strict entrance exams. Send them our way. Take anybody. Complete activities, uh, decrease support, you get tech points, and skilled recruits have abilities or weapons that are valuable to dead sync. Oh, cool. Neato. What's this little marker on our screen right in front of us? <laughs> Parcel delivery? <laughs> you could be a Amazon driver. <laughs> well, fuck me, you're still alive. I owe have been a tenor. Not only that, but your resistance handiwork just <laughs> opened up a whole new source of information. So now I spy with my hypothetical eye something interesting at the Ministry of Civic Management. What is it? The Signals Intelligence Response Service, or SIRS, or the Earl Grey Gestapo, have developed a surveillance technology called AR this guy's Reconstruction. Not happy. It's the leading edge of privacy rights violation, and thus it could be very useful in our attempts to find Zero Day. Well, I'm walking here. Hey, I'm walking here. Oh, no. Nope, you should not. I gotta figure out how to do that. <laughs> okay, if there's a uh, way to do it. Oh, there we go. Okay. There we go. Okay. Woo! Figured uh, running around with my gun out was not a good idea. Playing a harmonica. Everybody loves him. I should recruit him. I do like the concept of all, that you can basically recruit anybody. It looks like. I mean, you want to recruit her? All right, do it. Like that's really a, a, a very interesting idea. What's this red area over here? Uh oh. Donkey. Gotcha. One in here. Come on. Not liking this. Not liking this at all. Okay, 
Knock him out. Thank you. Okay, she's out. Oh no, he got me. <laughs> Ready for action? Here we go again. Let's try that again. Here we go. Let's let's play a little smarter. I love how they still blur you out. I think that's so cool. Well, that wasn't all I was trying to do. Oh, so if you get knocked out by them, they become your adversary. Oh. Good to know. Call spider bot, okay. That goes all the way out to that way. Him. Boom. Got her. Perfect. Don't don't wanna don't wanna mess with that. That looks like a baddie. That looks like a bad thing. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, I think this might be a good place to pause it. We'll continue our journey in the next episode and uh, help out our uh, good dead sec buddies. So thank you all for watching. I really do appreciate it. If you can, give the video a like. It does help me out quite a bit. Also, check out the channel because they have tons of videos going on over there. And until next time, you guys, stay frosty.